My drama classroom is my, my haven. It's, it's where I, I come alive. Welcome to Mr G's room, G's room, G's room. Welcome to Mr G's room, come inside. Most of the time it's just chill out with bean bags, pillows, cushions, that sort of thing. And take your shoes off and find a spot on the floor. Welcome to Mr G's room, G's room. My teaching methods are fairly unique. Someone join in. Um, I get pretty experimental and I go crazy sometimes. I just, I just let loose. Enter the room. <laughs> oh, thank God you're here. I've, I've been shot. Thank God you're here. Where have you been, bitch? Boring is not a word that you hear in this room. Spin around, Chinaman, spin around, spin around. If there's something boring to do, then we find a fun way of doing it. <laughs> and he's dead. Slap the butcher. Slap the butcher is one of the fun games that we play. <laughs> It deals with the idea of possession in, in theatre. One thing that I like to do from time to time is I just perform for the kids for a, for a whole lesson, just to give them a sort of benchmark of how things are done. So they can see it's someone at, at a professional industry level handles um, the performance side of things. And that, in a way, gives them Confidence. Row. Row, 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 row. There's still a drama syllabus that I have to cover. Most of what I do has a grounding in education. There is a lesson to be learned. They love it when you they do love it. it when you do. Yeah, I read yeah. an article about all the sluts in public schools. Really? It's so bad. Not all the time. There are more sluts in public schools. Yeah, oh, yeah. No yeah definitely. Sorry, Shane. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get me. Don't get me. <laughs> Sorry. 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 I yeah. think what happens is like out yeah. in the outer suburbs, like ugly people breed with other uh, ugly people, yeah. right? Oh. So then it was really fucky kids. Yeah. That's why yeah. you look around a public school and on average, like no offense, but people are more fugly. Whereas in but there's a like private school like area, yeah, in a I rich school area, house. shut up and let me explain. Okay. In a rich area, like hotter people breed with other hot people and have hotter kids. Oh, yes. Wait. Yes. Don't, Don't aim for me, please. It's getting stupid Seriously. now. I know. Over the time that I'm here, I want to like get to know everyone, like all the year 11s, all the teachers and stuff. Hi, Mr. Cameron. Hi, Jamie. And I guess do what I can to make some changes around the school, like make a better environment for everyone. Academically, um, like the standard's pretty low here, so it's probably going to be really easy, like no offense. But I know I'm really going to miss my Hilford friends and stuff, and um, that's going to be really bad, and I just don't want to be in classrooms so there's like no air conditioning and like asbestos in the roof and stuff and oh and no and just crap desks and like cringe. skanky bogans everywhere and sluts You've and, got art. It's and not I that just bad. wish I was with my friends and I wish I was going back to Hill. Jermaine, you've got us to do this. Ben says that you were the ringleader, Jonah. That it was oh, you shit. who threw his bag over the train line. Yeah, because it was supposed to be funny. Yeah. He it's didn't laugh. Too. Look, how is it okay for you to bully Ben? Because he's a ringer. A what? A ringer, sir. Because he's got red hair, a ringer yeah. team. That's what we call him. And does that make it okay for him to be bullied because he has red hair? Well, people are racist to, to folks. us. See, to see we could be racist to, to ringers. To but redheads aren't a race, Jonah. But, sir, there's heaps of them. They're no, everywhere. Look, I'll tell you what's going to happen, okay? You're going to clean this off Ben's bag. It's not going to come okay? off. Okay? The other thing is, you're not going to catch the train anymore. Bullshit! And that means that your father's going to have to pick you up and drop you off at school every day. And it's I don't think he's going to be very happy, is he, Jonah? I wasn't the only you ringleader. Are not These boys making made it too. It easy. Do you want this to go to Miss Murray? Take a joke. Don't you even know what punk is? Jonah, Why don't you watch look, MTV for once? Do you want to come back this afternoon and try this again, do you? Or are you going to look at Ben and say, sorry, Ben? Sorry, homo. No, Jonah, that's not acceptable. Try again. Sorry, Rona. Jonah, you are going to acknowledge Ben as a human being. Now, look at him and say, sorry, Ben. You want to come? Sorry, Ben! No, Jonah, politely and properly apologise to Ben. Okay, I'll look at him. 
Yes. And shake his hand. Yes. And say sorry, Ben. Sorry, Ben, motherfucker. No, Jonah. He's a fucking homo. I've been a senior drama teacher here for nine years now. Coffee, coffee, coffee before we teachy teachy. Welcome to Mr G's room, G's room. If there's something boring to do, then we find a fun way of doing it. Slap the butcher. I'm going to slap you, Emily. I'm, I'm dealing with you. a principal who does not get God what it me. takes to run a successful drama department. Wow. The world has gone back to People say drama. Oh, it's a bludge subject. It's a poor subject. Wrong. Drama changes lives. What's the difference between a dick and a penis? This is Jonah's third school in 18 months. You're a legend, sir. Jonah is an at-risker. I miss you, father. He comes from a single-parent family. What the fuck you say to me? Fuck you, motherfucker! There are attention deficit issues. So don't come in, I'm pissing! Bullshit! There's a, a problem with aggression. Two minutes, pussy. You got your period or what, miss? Teachers at this school are so racist. What I would like to see is him not get expelled again. Sorry, Ben! I'm not dumb, I'm just choosing not to be smart at the moment, and they don't get that. My friends think I'm an idiot. They're like, why would you go to Summer Heights High? It's like the boganest school in the world. It's a swap program. Girls like me are offered a world of opportunity. Yes, I come from one of the most expensive private girls' schools in the state, but I'm actually really cool. It's way less, like, povo than I thought it would be. I don't want to brag, but I think they wanted someone decent looking. You'll fit in, there's so many Asians there. Wife beaters and rapists are nearly all public school educated. I love your fins, they're so random. Sorry, no offense, but it's true. Hello. Hello. You never knew what we might do. I'm starting on Monday. The brain. Motherfucker. In an amazing environment.